We've received some questions about guardian litems. So I'm Heather O'Connor from O'Connor Family Law, and we're gonna get those questions answered for you. Who pays for the GAL? That really depends on what the judge orders. Typically, if you're asking for a GAL in Massachusetts, the judge is going to order that both parties pay. Now, what can happen in certain situations is the judge can say, well, parent A is going to pay upfront subject to reallocation, which basically means that after the investigation is all over, the judge can then go back and say, okay, well, even though this parent paid all of it, we're still gonna make this other one responsible for some or all of the costs. Now, another thing that can happen, and again, don't go into requesting a GAL hoping that the state will pay. However, the court can appoint a GAL and have the state pay for it. So those are the three ways you're typically going to see a GAL paid for. So I hope that was helpful. Heather O'Connor, O'Connor Family Law, and I hope you have a great day.